Hi there learners and welcome to today's video where we are going to be chatting about calculations with bar scales. So um, remember this is what a bar scale looks like. Apologies for my artwork <laughs> but um, that is what our bar scale looks like. So we're going to use an example um, as to how to actually calculate distance because we are looking at making a measurement on a map and then being able to take that measurement and turn it into a, a distance that we can use on the ground. So it might be two, three centimeters on the map, but we want to know if I were to really travel on the ground, you know, walk, drive, whatever it is, what's the distance um, in the real world going to be? Or in other words, what we call the actual distance. Okay, so let's use an example. Um, and they mentioned to us that our distance on the map is seven centimeters and we need to work out what the actual distance is going to be right they also make mention of the fact that in this case one centimeter is equal to 10 kilometers in other words the distance from zero to 10 kilometers over here because this is all in kilometers um, this is one centimeter and that information they would give you okay so once we've got that <clears throat> we want to now get to our seven centimeters so what are we going to do in order to get to seven centimeters i would have to multiply by seven but if i'm going to do that i don't know what the side is going to be okay but if i've done it to the one side i'm going to have to do it to the other side so now what's going to happen is I'm going to have my 10 kilometers multiplied by 7 and that's going to give me 70 kilometers. So this basically then means that my 7 centimeters on the map is equal to 70 kilometers of what we call actual distance. Now, let's look at another example. Here you can see we have a bar scale and you'll also notice with our bar scales, we have different segments. And this one is going zero, five kilometers, 10 kilometers, 15 kilometers and 20 kilometers. Now they say to us, use the bar scale, this particular one, to find the actual distance if the measurement on the map is 26 centimeters. Okay, so the first thing we're going to end up doing is measuring our segments and that segment should measure according to the example at two centimeters. Now, once we know that, we can then put that down that two centimeters is basically equal to five kilometers. Remember, we are expressing this as a ratio. But we, we want to get this down to one centimeter, you know, so that we have that ratio of like one to 50, you know, one to five or whatever it is. And the only way we're going to be able to do that is to divide by two. And then I'm going to have to divide this by two as well. And that'll give me 2.5 kilometers. Now, I now know what my ratio is for one centimeter. How many centimeters do they want me to check? They want me to get the actual distance based on 26 centimeters. So what am I going to have to do? I'm going to have to multiply by 26 to get 26 centimeters. And I'm going to have to multiply by 26 on this side as well. And that should give me 65 kilometers. That then is my actual distance.